Hi Dog Lover 101 here. So today I'm going to be opening up Groovy Babe. LOL OMG Neon Lights. And I feel stupid because I didn't realize there was a little tab that you're supposed to pull to open the dolls. So instead of doing the easy way, I've been opening them the hard way. So much easier. So anyhow, I'm just bad at following directions. So pretty. I'm going to pull her out so you can see her background before I throw it out. So hers is pretty cool. I do not keep the backgrounds. Sorry about that, but I don't. Oh, and also they do come with instructions, but everybody throws those out, so it doesn't matter. And her stand is black. So there. So if you ever forget what stand goes with what doll, just look at reviews on YouTube. So, yep. She comes with one of these little things, little poster or sticker that goes for like one of the houses. She also comes with a jacket thingy that just fell off, so I'll be putting that on her. She is giving me like 60s vibes, you know? Is it 60s or 70s? I think it's 60s. Although I could be wrong, I do not know. She's super pretty. Okay. So now I got the complete collection of all four of these dolls. I love it when I complete a collection. Come on. There. Throw it to the side. So her hair is pretty soft. Oh, I missed a little thing. And I'm sorry if you guys hear my dad's radio in the background. He just kind of blasts it. Oh my, she's super cute. Okay. She's got a little bit of excess hair going on, so might have to trim that. So I'm going to do that now because it's going to drive me crazy. There we go. Much better. So I just trimmed off the excess stuff that was going like that. So I'm going to put her jacket on her. And about these dolls, something I love is they all have painted nails, which I always forget to mention. So her nails are painted white. I would have preferred if they did like a pattern one white one black or one black one white if they would have done both colors every other nail that would have been cool a lot cooler in my opinion but what can you do i guess they did that because they just gave you a black stand although that would have been cool to have a pattern on it too oh her hair is so soft I'm pretty sure this one has earrings. Anyhow, I'm going to show you guys a close-up before I forget. So, her hair is mostly white with some black streaks in it. She's got some 
weird looking bangs. But they're actually kind of cute on her. She's got purple eyes, blue eyeshadow, like a almost turquoise or light blue. She's got nice pink lips, light pink. Then she's got this really cool design going on here, but then it kind of clashes with this design here. Then she's got polka dots on top of that, all black and white. Then look at these shoes. I love them. They're like wedge shoes. Then they've got a little bit of white on the heel. Now, let's see. I'm going to grab the little light thing I have beside me. Oh, so she doesn't have as much detail. Oh, she gets a swirl in her eye. I don't know if that's picking up on camera. But besides that, not really too much. And her hair goes all pretty. Okay. So, that's a little bit disappointing that she doesn't have as much with the little UV or black light thing as the other one for details. A bit upsetting. Oh, she comes with a thing that says groovy poems. Whoop, I just threw that somewhere. Gonna see if it said anything, but I guess I'll have to find it after the video. Oh, and she comes with a white hat box. comes with a white UV light or black light. Why do I keep calling them UV light? I don't know. And oh my, her earrings are trippy and they actually swirl. Attention to detail. Again, Mattel, take notes. Oh, not a fan of her glasses. I'll just put them on the top of her head then. Okay. So I think I would have preferred if my Dazzle actually came with earrings instead of the bracelet. Because each of them have two accessories. And I always find earrings better than a bracelet, in my opinion. Especially when the doll comes with holes in her head. Okay. So, put this in group babes ears so I love MGA dolls and their attention to detail because this feels like something I'd get back in 2010 when I first collected monster high dolls of course I lost most of their accessories right after I got my first ones so her hair is really soft Anyhow, that's about it I have to say about Groovy Babe. So, please like with a big thumbs up, comment down below if it lets you, and subscribe. Bye! Bye.